Welcome back everybody. Hope you're having a good Monday. So on today's video, I thought I'd bring in a couple guests. So I thought it'd be fun to bring in Jade, Riley, and Suni onto my channel and just kind of talk to them a little bit about their thoughts with everything that's happened, kind of what's going on with their daily life. So I hope you guys like this video. I'm excited to be talking to them. I haven't spoken with them since everything has happened really i mean a couple texts here and there so so excited to hear what they're gonna say and let's kick it yo yo cute shirt thanks <laughs> welcome um Wait like another minute just to see if Suni comes on and then if she ends up jumping on, I guess we can add her. But I was maybe going to mention this in the video, but like I went tubing on Wednesday with my sister and we yeah. had like a super big wake and I was on it with like Colton and Maddie. So they're like super tiny, my nieces and nephew. And so mm -hmm. we like came down super hard so my neck like crunched and I was like, <laughs> you know, so I had like... <laughs> super stiff neck for two days and then my brother-in-law has horses and they have like a cabin so like in the summertime they take them up there because it's hotter down here and uh -huh. we went horseback riding on friday and i've gone horseback riding like my whole life and mm -hmm. i got bucked off the horse oh, yeah <laughs> you the from it no i didn't because it happened friday when we went horseback riding i texted lisa and i was like um, so this happened, and I can't really <laughs> move, so I can't come to practice, and she's like, oh my gosh, like, I hope you're okay, whatever, so I didn't go into gym, and then I went to therapy today, and she's like, let's just take Monday off, because I'm still, like, really sore, and then she's like, if we need to take two more days, we can, so I went to therapy, and she's like, yeah, I don't want you doing anything for at least two more days, just because I could, like, with how swollen it is and stuff, like, they don't want it to, like, I could like tear a muscle in the back of my leg. Oh, yeah. And then my neck had this like weird problem because it was already stiff and I like couldn't turn my neck to the side. So like <laughs> I've literally had like a mental breakdown because my body is like hurting so bad. But I went to the chiropractor oh. yesterday and stuff. Um, so that was like that helped a lot. And then I went to therapy today and my knee's fine and everything. It's just bruised, but it was wild. Oh, that's crazy. That doesn't sound fun. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm like, what the heck? I'm like, the one time I go to have fun and I get, like, hurt. Stupid. I don't know. Okay, so today we have our three special guests, Riley, Jade, and Suni, joining me today on my YouTube channel. I've been so excited to have them be a part of this and to let you guys kind of know what's been going on and kind of have a part of their daily life as well. So, um, so we're going to get started. Um, how have you guys been feeling with the whole changes and everything? Um, what's it been the last couple weeks and just how are you doing? Um, uh, I think it was hard for both of us at first, honestly, mm -hmm. but we've kind of accepted it and now we're moving on with whatever's next. Yeah, it was definitely hard in the beginning, but I think we're bouncing back now and that this extra time will actually be pretty good for us. Mm -hmm. Definitely. It's, it's been hard for me, especially because, you know, you know, I had this goal of only coming back for a year and then knowing yeah. that this extra year, I'm just like, crap. Like, <laughs> are you so, like it's nice knowing we an extra year because it gives us so much more time. But at the same time, it was yeah. like, I'm not expecting this. I didn't really know if I wanted this to happen. So it's been, I don't know, it's been kind of rough for me, but um, it's kind of exciting at the same time, and it kind of gives me a way to, like, get to know you guys better and um, get to have one last year with you guys before you guys move into life. Um, question number two is, how did you guys feel when you heard the Olympics got pushed back a year? Um, I was really upset just because – it was hard knowing that we were going to have to continue to go another year, but I definitely think it was the right, the right decision for all the athletes and for everyone's safety. 
but, but it was definitely tough at first. Yeah. Well, I was really upset at first because that meant I was kind of have to defer college another year, which I was really looking forward to going this year. But now I'm kind of excited that I have like a whole nother year to work new things and upgrade my routines. Yeah, I was definitely very upset um, because it's, I feel like it's been my dream for so long and for it to be pushed back another year was definitely difficult. But now that I have another year to kind of work harder and get better, I feel a lot better. Um, were all of you guys supposed to go to college this next year? Yes, I was supposed to go in 2018. Yeah. Is that the yeah. same for you, Riley? Or did you? Uh, I, yeah, I'm just one year after Jade, so I was supposed okay. to go one year, or this year right now, and then I'm, I'll end up, like, in total deferring two years. But. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm doing three now. And I'm supposed to go to college. You what? In I'm supposed to go to college in the summer of 2021. Okay. So, yeah, we are all on the same boat, kind of. We're all struggling here. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know, like, we've all been talking about it, being able to go to college and kind of start our different lives. Um, I know elites hard and it sucks sometimes, but uh, this is just crazy. Like, for me now, like, I'm like, I don't even know, like, will I go to college after this? Because now I have to add a whole nother year. Yeah. yeah, it's so hard. Like, and then you just your senior year again? Like, sorry, what did you say, Riley? Would you just compete your senior year when you go back? Yeah, I just have my senior year. It's like it's so hard because it was already hard for me to like try to stay like motivated to be like, okay, like I gotta go to college after this. Do one more year, one more year of gymnastics. Like, I can do it. Like, I was trying. Like, I mean, I've told Jade, I'm like, I don't know, like. I, want to go back but I don't know we're gonna have to see how things happen and Jade's like you need to come back so we can complete a year of college together I'm like I know but <laughs> I'm tired I'm exhausted I don't want to do gym um <laughs> we we could still do it we can especially for you because you've got a long we'll way we'll be in the pack 12 together <laughs> <laughs> I know it would be so fun I'm trying to stay like as positive as I can and I'm like we'll see what happens but this is just like I can't even imagine how you're feeling Jade like Going on three years. I mean, that will be. Yeah. Great. I deferred my freshman. I was very upset at first, but it is what it is. Yeah. yeah. Did she say, or, or Lisa said she heard something like you're going to be taking classes or anything like that. Yeah. I'm going to start like some online stuff in June. Okay, cool. And I'm just going to do a little bit just so I can get a little bit out of the way yeah. before I get there. That's smart. Especially since you'll miss like this summer going in. Yeah. So question number four, this one's for you, Riley. So how do you like the Arizona heat? We're in the hundreds this whole week. How are you feeling? I love it so far. Nice. Back in New Jersey, it's like 40 degrees and raining. So I'm not complaining about it being 100 <laughs> degrees. <laughs> when it hit 100, Riley was like, it's so hot. And I'm like, wait till we're at 120. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I just swamp coolers, so it's like yeah, cool. that's rough. Uh, I know. I've been like sweating so bad that I'm like getting acne. Like where am I? That <laughs> is, it's so bad. Uh, I'm literally dying here, and it's only 75. <laughs> <laughs> this is the hot. That's cold for so us. Much. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so hot. Well, Suni, we'll be wishing we're on your side sooner or later here because it's <laughs> It's fine. I keep yeah. saying it's hot, and Jade's like, you just wait. And I'm like, no, it's hot. I'm from the Northeast. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're really probably going to struggle. You'll probably get, like, heat stroke. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I'm worried about her. <laughs> uh, but your gym, your new gym has air conditioning, right? Yeah. Yeah, so that yeah. should help some. Yeah, that'll yeah, that will help. Like, I'm in the whole like building. I've been training like three and a half weeks. Are you serious? <laughs> oh my gosh. What did that, you are you yeah, what, what are you doing? I have to do like, well, I do like Zoom workouts with my coaches and then I go like on runs and stuff, but I'm not like, I can't do any gymnastics. Wow, that's yeah. Crazy. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so crazy because I feel like in Arizona, like it hasn't really affected anyone that bad. No, it, it's not bad here. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, mean, I can't imagine what like, all these other people are going through because it literally sucks. Like, I'm like, 
I would literally go crazy, like, to have to sit in my house all day long. Ugh. Yeah. yeah. So we're going to go on to question number five. Oh, wait. I was going to ask something. What did you guys vote about for the championships? I voted no champ. I voted no also. Because, <gasps> oh, you have five weeks until championships? That would be rough. But then I think, like, the other thing It's dangerous, too. Yeah. yeah, I think the other thing that would suck is, like, having to do championships. Like, let's say, like, you know, people wanted to compete, and then we had championships, like, at, like, towards the end of the year. I feel like that would just suck. Like, who would want to do Yeah. That? Yeah, like, that's, it's, there's really no point. It's too late. Then it's too close to next year because next year is mm -hmm. going to be – everything's going to be earlier. Yeah. 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 I, like, I feel like we should just take the rest of the season off and then just work on upgrades and stuff. Mm -hmm. Because I feel like it's just kind of stupid to have to come back for yeah. championships. When it's, I don't like, think it's the that only thing, deal. I think the only thing they're worried about is how they're going to pick the national team. But yeah. I think they should just leave it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just yeah. keep that. Mm -hmm. If someone does really good at a camp or something and they're not on the national team, he can just add them. Yeah, yeah. I kind of wrote that in, like, the extra comments. Because, yeah, that's what I, I did, too. Yeah, because it's, like, I feel like now that we get this extra year, we might as well take the time to, like, be able to, like, really focus and work on things instead of just, like, trying to, like, throw in meets that are just unnecessary. It's, like, we wouldn't have yeah. other championships anyway, so why have an extra one, you know? Like, it was supposed to be the Olympic year. We're only supposed to have one more left anyway, so why do we need to do – I don't know. Yeah. I, I could see for them because they probably would like to make money off of it. But yeah. With everything that's happening, who knows? It's not about them. The you know? Yeah. It's like I don't even know if it's it's people. I think like people literally come to watch us. Like they, I feel like they can't decide that because we're not ready. So we don't want to show like bad gymnastics. You know, people pay money to watch us. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. And who knows? Like I feel like so many people have been so devastated with all this. I don't think we'd be in the right mind to even like. Yeah, no. Can you just like jump back in the gym and be like, oh, gotta get ready for a meet? Like, I feel yeah. like it's stupid. Ugh. So dumb. I hope they don't have it. So, okay, so we're gonna go on to question number five. What do you guys think about the age elig eligibility change? I think that it was wrong. Yeah, I think it was really unfair. Yeah, if they're still going to call it the 2020 Olympics, then everything needs to stay the way that it was going to be. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I agree for sure. And it, I've talked to a lot of people, and, like, I did a – I guess not a podcast. I did, like, this interview thing with Sean, and she was mm -hmm. just one of the other athletes, like – are staying the same. They're not changing the rule for it because it's still considered. Right. Yeah, they yeah. are. They're, I saw they put out a thing and it's like the ages are going to be the exact same yeah. as they were. Yeah. And yeah. And there's no, like, no hate towards any of the juniors mm -hmm. now. No. Uh -uh, but it's but just, it's yeah, it's just not fair to us because now there's a whole bunch more athletes that could now go. Yeah, and it's like it wasn't even their Olympics to begin with anyway. Right. Ready to yeah, and for years. them too, they've been – pacing for 2024 mm -hmm. and now yeah. they're all gonna all of a sudden try to do it for this one year yeah. that they weren't trying for in the first place it's crazy I don't know I I really hope that there is some way that they can change it maybe but I know like they've said like oh well they just are scared they're gonna get sued from like the juniors or other people that you know want to have the chance to do it so that's why but i don't get that either because it's the 2020 olympics still I and i feel like so how can you do that because if they were all working towards 2024 already i feel like they could just go back to that plant since we don't have any competitions mm -hmm. you can still keep pacing yourself like they don't have to work towards the olympics yeah yeah mm -hmm. for sure it's crazy Okay, so number six, what is your new game plan to prepare for the Olympics now that we have another year? Um, I'd say definitely try to upgrade a little since yeah. you've been getting this time that you wouldn't formally have. And I think you should just like take advantage of it almost. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I yeah, think I'm I agree. Try and work on upgrades and like consistency because I feel like I kind of lack on that. 
Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I just want to stay in like top five, top four. I think like watching us from like the last camp, like it's so weird because I know by the time the Olympic or the Olympic trials were going to happen, I think we obviously would have been like on our A game. But like looking back at the last camp, I'm like, it's kind of nice that we get extra time to train because like I didn't feel totally ready either. Like in the moment. <laughs> I think we were all yeah. kind of work stuff out we of were all out of that camp. Uh huh. Yeah. So I was half asleep at that camp. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got sent to gym next, and I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. Because I had just gotten back from Australia, mm -hmm. and I still had to come, and I was like, is it three in the morning? I think so. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That was rough. I don't know how you did that. I would have been like, Yeah, I was like, why is Jade coming to this camp? Like, no. I was like, she just competed in the time <laughs> change. Like, that's so rough. Okay. I have like two more questions and then see what you guys have been doing the last few months. Have you guys been watching Netflix? Chilling at home? What are your guys' favorite TV shows lately? I'm watching All American right now. Nice. I started oh, not one yet, but I like it so far. <laughs> I started watching Lucifer. Lucifer? Um, oh, that? I've heard of that. It's really good. Like, you guys should watch it. I've been watching Vampire Diaries. Kind of cheesy. Oh, my gosh. It's so I love that show. No, I watched it, like, a long time ago, but Netflix didn't have, like, all the seasons. So, mm -hmm. like, I watched up to, like, a certain point. And then I was like, well, I don't want to, like, watch it by myself now that I'm married. So, like, me and Jim <laughs> started from the beginning, and we're watching that. So pretty addicting it's so good i just started new girl and it's actually really funny oh I like yeah i agree with that you I, watched never watched that. I know a lot of people like it but i haven't mm -hmm. it's on netflix nice okay oh mick i still have to watch that show that like game show one. Oh, the circle yeah oh my gosh i watched oh, that so funny. i was watching that at camp <laughs> yeah i haven't watched it yet it's like it's I feel like like at the beginning you're it's like you know it's explaining it all and it's kind of kind of boring but kind of interesting but it gets like yeah. really good once you like know all the characters and what's going on and it gets like super fun and like intense. yeah Great. it's I really, really like that show like I want them to come out with another season no did you know they have one in like they Brazil Brazil yeah that's what it was yeah I watch it but I was like oh that's interesting I know I tried to watch it I was like I can't understand anything I'm not watching this <laughs> Um, have you guys done anything fun? I mean, I know some of you kind of have been able to leave the house much, but I mean, it gives us more time to go outside. I've seen Jade and Ryan. I went camping. You went camping? Yeah, I, I think yeah. last weekend. Fun. What? Is your sister pregnant? Yeah. She's so cute. I saw the picture and I was like, oh my gosh, I think you might have said something, but I couldn't remember. Yeah, she is having a girl. I'm oh. so excited. Oh my gosh, cute. That is cute. I love babies. Yes, I'm so excited. We're going to be getting an aunt. <laughs> Auntie Jean. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anything else exciting, fun, crazy? Not really. Not really. I'm like literally stuck in the house. I can't do anything. That's terrible. Do you have, like, any equipment at home to, like, do a little bit of stuff, like, parallel? No. Nope. Wow. So I just do, like, presses and, like, hands and stuff on the ground. Um, and then I go on, like, four-mile runs. I can't run. <laughs> <laughs> I died. We, we had to do, like, a mile run at Utah my freshman year. They got rid of that, but we had to, like, test mile run. And mm -hmm. I really almost puked, and it was a mile because we had a like, <laughs> amount of time. And I did not pace myself good whatsoever. It was horrible. I can't run. And then I went jogging with my sister like two miles once, like my sophomore or junior year. We went jogging, and we're just going really slow. And I come back, and I could not walk on my foot. And they thought I fractured my foot, but I didn't. Mm -hmm. but, like, I can't. Running is just not my thing. So props to you for getting out running because. Thanks. Yeah. Practice is so hard when I come back, though. Like, I'm not even going to know how to do anything. No. But, but think about it this way. At least you get time to, like, 
recover. Yeah, you'll have a lot of time. That was hurting. Mm -hmm. I think it would be kind of good to come down a little bit. I mean, I know it's hard in a league to do such hard, crazy skills. But like yeah. in college, you know, you compete so much, you train so much, like for the whole season, and then like kind of coming down in the summer, I just feel like really helps you like recoup and like get your mind to like go back full speed again. And mm -hmm. Yeah, like it'll be nice because in the summer, like I feel like I'll be able to have more like free time mm -hmm. and like I'll get to hang out with friends and stuff. But at the same time, like I won't be seeing you guys for a long time. So like I want champs just to see my friends, you know? Yeah. I know. That's the reason I love championship. So. Same. Do you guys think we'll have a camp? <laughs> I, think I don't so. know. But they probably will fit one in there, I'm sure, somewhere. Once my they get he thinks, like, there will be one in, like, September or something. Hopefully. Wait, what month are we in right now? April? April. Yeah. Almost May. Wow, that's a long time. That's, like, oh. one month till my birthday from today. What? Wow. What's the date today? What? What's the date today? The 27th. No. Oh. So, May 22nd. How old are you going to be, Jade? 20? 27. <laughs> What? 27. 27. How old are you going to be? Wait. Oh, 20. <laughs> I'll be 20. You're going to be 20. Crazy. I'm going to be 27. <laughs> <laughs> that is so crazy. Well, I miss you guys so much. I miss you, you too. 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 I miss all. Yeah. Same. Even though, like, I'm a grandma, you guys are like, how old are <laughs> well thanks for being a part of my youtube channel i hope we can do more stuff or hopefully there'll be like some meets we can be together so i can film something for that that'd be fun yeah yes definitely. video i think we should make a camp video yeah i was just gonna say that make a camp video yes yeah, just a vlog like a behind the scenes like <laughs> you know after all this crap something like the first camp back or something we'll have to do like a video Whatever. yeah we can we can video me rolling you on my suitcase <laughs> <laughs> we can reenact the crash hey, well you need to bring that that same suitcase okay, well i will just for that <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh okay and well, we can video our um straw and ketchup sports yes oh my gosh that was so funny <laughs> That got so intense. It did. So intense. Competitiveness came out real good right there. <laughs> oh. All right. Well, Jade Riley, when this stuff gets better, we all should go do something. Yes. yes. It'd be fun. Maybe I like introduced Riley to um Dutch Bros and In and Out. Yep. What? No. She hasn't had canes yet. No, I haven't. Next How far do you live from each other? Um, We're probably like 40 minutes. Yeah. Oh, that's not bad at I all. I feel like you're you close live by my mom. I on my Snapchat map, I'm near you, Michaela. Really? Yeah. No way. Okay, well, let's... Well, she lives... She lives... Riley lives on like um, 56th Street in Thomas. So really, she's like 30 minutes from you. Oh, okay. So yeah, that's not too bad then. And you can yeah. mom's house anyway. So you're kind of close when you do that. Or I guess you're yeah. right. Yeah. Cooney, you can come join us on a call tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, okay. we'll FaceTime you in. Okay. Uh, well, I'll just fly down there really quick when it's oh, fly down. Yeah. yeah. Do that. You can live with me. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this train. That'd be so she fun. Can, she can rotate. Me and Grace can come, and then we can all just train together. Mm -hmm. yeah. That would be so fun. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, I'll let you guys get back to your boring lives. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thanks again so much for doing this. It really means a lot. Um, it was such late notice, but uh, you guys are the best, and I love you all. Stay safe, and I'll talk to you guys. Bye. I love you guys. Bye. I love you. Bye.